This team is extremely confident. Probably as confident as any team we've went against in my eight years about what they're going to do and how they're going to do it. All right, so you're going to be challenged. I'm just telling you that right now. All right, and it's going to be a 48 minute challenge. Football's always meant to be fun. Make sure you smile and have fun. Do your job, and the outcome will take care of itself. They're pretty cocky, who cares? Do your job, all right? And the outcome takes care of itself. Who got my back? I got your back. Who got my back? I got your back. Who got my back? I got your back. Okay. Oh my dog. Oh my dog. Oh my dog. Dr. DeGay led the vision and construction of the Senior Academy in 2009. Under Dr. DeGay's leadership, EHS has won five IHSAA state championships. For the last 27 years, Dr. Brett DeGay! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Cheryl. Cheryl will flip it to Allinger. It's a Philly special. He throws it back to Dunn. Is he going to be able to get in? Yes, he is. Touchdown, Brownsburg. Jake Dunn on the receiving end from Caden Allinger.
coaches made some great adjustments at halftime, and our kids listened to it. And Garrett Sherrill is, is just a special, special player. And uh, I, I, I think some of the people I'm most proud of, Jake Dunn throws an interception before half uh, and comes back and plays incredible in the second half. Trey, we kind of been on him pretty tough and stuff and makes a, probably the biggest catch of the game. And, uh, and then our defense just came out and, and played really well. I, I would like to, before uh, the next question, uh, Dr. Brett DeGay, uh, uh, easily the best principal I've ever had. He's, he's a great man. I, I, uh, I love that guy to death. And, and this school is, uh, owes him and this community and me owe him forever as far as I'm concerned. Second half adjustments, you know, we take those very seriously. Way more than other teams do. We come out, you know, do what we got to do. And they preach, do your job. And, you know, first half, we was worried about what the defense could do, what the offense can do. We were worried about what we are doing. And second half, we came out, made adjustments, do, do our job. Came out there, scoreless half, you know what I'm saying? Real proud of the defense. A halftime talk, Coach Poppy always puts it in there. And, man, we just got fired up in the locker room. We uh, came back to fix things, and that's what, that's what sealed the deal. Can't get down. Can't get down at all. Emotionally, it's it's, an, it's a mental game, so you just got to come back and then you're going to win. This is a team full of fighters. We get doubted all the time. Everybody's doubting us, but we proved them wrong. I think when we were in that locker room at halftime, everybody still knew it was our game. We knew it was our game. Nobody, nobody ever believed we were going to lose, and we came out and we proved it.